A fraternity at the University of Oklahoma is facing a hazing scandal, and it involves the son of a well-known former Dallas Cowboy. Fox 4's Shannon Murray is here with details. Well, Dan, Jay Novacek's son Blake is suing Beta Theta Pi and two of its members after a 2015 incident at the OU chapter. It's the second scandal in one year for the fraternity. In February, a Beta Theta Pi pledge died during a hazing event at its Penn State University chapter. Now Blake Novacek says he suffered a head injury during a hazing incident at OU in 2015. The lawsuit claiming a drunk fraternity member hit Novacek in the stomach with a baseball bat and he fell and hit something, knocking him unconscious. It goes on to say a different fraternity member later told Novacek to quote, keep his mouth shut about the hazing incident or else they would ruin his and his family's reputation. Attorney Chris Cook says Novacek had a traumatic brain injury and has not been the same ever since. And there's also this picture, a broken nose at a barn dance party, which as of right now is not part of that lawsuit. The pledges were made to fight each other as the members and their dates looked on drinking beer for their own amusement. We didn't file it because of who his father is. We filed it to seek answers and seek changes within not just this fraternity, but fraternities nationwide. In a statement, Beta Theta Pi says we have performed an initial investigation of Blake's allegations. We have numerous witness accounts and other evidence which contradicts Blake's story and which questions his credibility. The fraternity also sent a photo from an Instagram account that we determined does not belong to Blake Novacek, but it appears to show him at a Cowboys game in Arlington October 11th. That's the date cited in the lawsuit for when the incident took place in Oklahoma. The team played the Patriots that day at 1.30 at AT&T Stadium. Novacek's attorney says the lawsuit should say on or around October 11th because with Blake's memory loss, he does not remember exactly which day it occurred. Shannon Murray on Good Day.